Hi, um, my name is Cyrus Huang, and I am a graduate student at uh, MERS Group at CCL. My research focuses on behavior prediction and uh, planning for autonomous vehicles. I want to start by talking about my project on this uh, multi-agent uh, behavior prediction. So behavior prediction is a very important task for autonomous systems because eventually those systems, they have to deal with humans. Uh, one of the, the requirements is to be able to uh, infer the, the future intentions or motions of those uh, of those agents nearby. So in this research, uh, we focus on be, uh, predicting multi-agent behavior prediction. Uh, for instance, if you imagine a, a vehicle driving on Boston streets, uh, it has to deal with uh, multiple humans or cyclists at the same time. So they are, they, that involves a lot of interactions, uh, which is quite uh, important, but also very challenging because the, the prediction problem is already very hard for even a single agent prediction, not even to mention for multiple agent predictions. Given two interactive agents, we first identify which agent is the influencer, they behave by themselves, and which agent is the reactor who reacts to the influencer agent. So in that, we basically divide the joint prediction problem into two separate prediction problems once we infer such a, um, an important relation between the interactive agents. So this is quite similar to what human thinks when they are dealing with other drivers on the road. They don't think about all the combinations of different drivers do. They basically think, okay, who has the right of the way and who will drive first and who will move next. Uh, this is very similar to how human thinks about about um, behavior uh, interactions when they reason about behavior prediction. We try to work with simpler algorithms based on deep learning to learn the behaviors from drivers or pedestrians or cyclists from, re from realistic driving data. So the algorithms work quite successfully. So um, basically it has three pieces. The first one is how can we predict on the relations such as the influencer and the reactor between the interactive pairs. And given that, the second part of the model is how can we predict the, um, the, the marginal trajectories for the influencer who, whose future motion does not depend on anyone else? And the last piece is how can we predict the future motions for the, uh, for the reactor agent who will basically re react to the future motion of the influencer agent? So those three modules are quite simple and they, they work really, really fast. So by putting those three together, we're, we're able to come up with a very accurate and fast algorithm that can predict the future human motions for up to eight seconds.